what's up people if the wind is distracting i apologize in advance but i am in atlanta at atlanta station and i got my camera back so it came in yesterday not yesterday but maybe yesterday week or whatever but i finally got it back and you know i want to shoot with it i want to see if it works like it's supposed to and i'm excited we're going to use the Portra 400 Hopefully it comes out right this time, because if it don't, we have this lady right here who is probably freezing <laughs> right now. I don't know why she didn't put on a jacket, but she thugging, so it's it is okay. what it is. I want to show my arm today. And them toes. <laughs> yeah. Got up here at the top. Technically, we're not even supposed to be up here, but guess what? We up here. So I'm thinking, let's not snitch on ourselves. So we got this spot down here, and then we have this spot here so we're gonna try to make it work with what we got um there's plenty of places to shoot here it's christmas going on you know you got a lot going on up here so we're gonna see what see what the vibe is even do this I'm gonna shoot this entire okay wait I'm gonna shoot the first row with the light meter inside the camera to see if that works after that I'm gonna try to use my best judgment in the other light meter that I have that I bought which is in the bag so I just want to make sure everything is working with the camera and if it's not I'm gonna be so pissed now we're trying to find a spot that has a little bit more color in it so that it's not just straight black and white and gray um maybe do something here i know it's not color but it's like i don't know it gives me the vibes i'm kind of looking for let's try that
absolutely honest with you, it is cold out here, like very cold. So we might not even do the second row. We're just gonna do the first one and basically test out the camera. And then after that, probably shoot next week with the external light meter, see how that goes. Cause right now we're losing the sun. When you're in the city, you have buildings. I'm not used to buildings, so the sun is being hit. So I got about four more shots. I'm gonna try to shoot it. And then we're gonna finish up and I'm gonna go warm up somewhere. So that's pretty much it. Um, we're gonna look at these whenever we get back at home and get them developed. It's probably gonna be a few days before I can get it back. Um, I'm excited how they came out. Next time I'm gonna do a lot more planning behind the shoot because everything I had on my mind did not work out the way it was supposed to. So wish me luck, fingers crossed. Next time you see me, I'll be back in the studio. Drink some water, man. It's good for you. All right, so I'm officially back at the house. Um, the scans and negatives have already been completed, and I like the way they came out. I'm satisfied with them. I think they're great. The first two pictures that I shot, they kind of were underexposed. Remember, we used the light meter from inside of the camera, and I don't know where it pulls its metering from for that, so. I don't know, but that's why we playing with it to figure this out. Um, <clears throat> so this camera has been a journey using. I am very happy to have it back. Um, if you've been with me from the first picture that I've taken with this to these current pictures, I really appreciate. I really appreciate it. it. Means a lot to me, and there's growth. I know there is, but. I'm gonna keep working, I'm gonna keep getting it. Also, a couple of these pictures were scanned by me. I used the ones that were from the lab that were scanned there as a reference. So therefore, I wouldn't be too far off and I kinda get a gist of how to do that. Be prepared for more of my pictures to be scanned by me that are negatives. I may go back and even redo some of them that I already have, but I don't know, that's, who knows? I don't, I don't know. Um, but yeah, we're gonna do another vlog on that. I may do it, I don't know. I don't know, I might do one about scanning my, my uh, negatives. I don't know yet, tough one. But um, anyway, my favorite one of these pictures would have to be the one with the guided lines, the little slanted, that wall right there. I really like that one. And I'd say the probably, I don't know, maybe the one in front of the silver silver wall. I don't know, I'm kind of, I'm a little bit torn, but yeah. If you guys got any tips and tricks for shooting film, drop them below. Also, I appreciate you guys watching and remember to subscribe and also be on the lookout for me shooting with Fujifilm 400, 120. I have two packs. So that's gonna be something too. Um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.